Hey you guys, welcome back. So I've had a lot of questions really since I put up a link to that Dyson hairdryer. Um, if you are subscribed to my newsletter or even following me on Snapchat, you'll know that I was stocking this hairdryer after my friend Dana told me about it about a month ago. It's Dyson's first ever beauty product and it's basically the best hairdryer out there now. That's what they're touting it as anyway. Um, they're basically saying it'll dry your hair in half the time using Dyson's technology for like vacuums and stuff. Um, protect heat from heat damage and all kinds of other good stuff. So I've been getting requests from y'all for a review of it and I just got it in the mail yesterday and I just blow dried this portion of my hair. Look how silky and smooth it looks. Love it. But I thought I'd wait and just blow dry this half for you so we can do that together. Okay, so I just got it and I just figured out all of the settings. So what's so cool about it is it comes with three different attachments and they're all magnetic. No more like pulling and ripping things off. It literally comes off like that. So easy. You can do it with, this is the, hmm, I don't know what the names are, smoothing something. It's, it smooths and finishes as it blow dries. This is the styling concentrator. It's a thinner version of this. Here, I'll hold them up together. So this is the smoothing and this is the styling concentrator to really get to target certain parts of your hair to dry it really fast. And then there's a diffuser, which I probably will never use because I don't have curly hair, but they all, it's so easy. They all just come right apart. Now, as far as the different settings, What's cool about this is that it has negative ions, which apparently reduce static is what it says. So you can tell, I mean, my hair usually has like all these baby hairs coming out, but you're not seeing them. So it works. Um, and then back here, this is the power button. You just slide it up. This is the cool shot. You'll see this on pretty much any hair dryer, but basically it helps you set a style in place. So say you use a round brush to curl it, with the hot air you curl it up and then before you let it go you use a cool shot on it to set the style so it stays longer so that's what that is the little blue dot and then up here you'll see there's one with a fan and one with a red dot the red dot is the heat control and there are four yeah four precise heat settings you can use and then this is the air control for airflow um, and air pressure and there are three controls for that now, when I first tried it, I was on the lowest setting and everyone kept telling me who'd used it. It was so powerful. And I was like, what? This is not powerful. Like my other hair dryer is better than that. I've had it for five years. I was on the lowest setting. <laughs> Trust me, it's powerful. And I will show you in just a moment. So I'm gonna do it without any of these first. So just so you can see the power of this thing, it's really hard to tell when you have one of the styling concentrators on, but. You hear that? I mean, here. It's like an airstream or a jet stream of some kind. But, like it's almost too strong. <laughs> Wanted to show y'all a close up of it. This has, this is the smoothing nozzle. Ooh, there we go, I forgot where the camera was. So <laughs> that's the smoothing nozzle. You can take it off so easily, it's magnetic. Negative ions equals no frizz, which is sort of exciting. Um, and then all the controls, here's close up, if you can see that. Red, fan, power, cold shot. Super simple, just press them a bunch of times to find the right setting you like. Um, but yeah, it's great. I'm not sure if I told you guys this, but the Dyson dryer I originally ordered I shipped to Austin because they said the estimated arrival date was like two to three weeks. And so I was not sure if it was gonna get in before I leave for Tokyo. So I sent it to my mom's house and it got there early. And I just told her to go ahead and try it cause she's really thick hair and we were both sort of looking at it. Um, but she was like, I'll just wait until you get it and try it and then I'll get one myself. Well, she liked it so much she decided to keep it and so she ended up having to buy one for me and I just got it in the mail yesterday um, but she has really thick hair um, and it's cut her drying time by a lot so that's definitely saying something because I don't have thick hair I can't really tell you how much it cuts my drying time because 
It literally only takes me five minutes to do anyway, but I will say it looks so much better with this hair dryer than it does with mine. I feel like the other one that I used so old, it just totally damages my hair. My split ends are super obvious. I have a lot of baby hairs after I blow dry with that. This is way better and I'm very glad I made the investment. It is expensive, no doubt about it, but you keep your hair dryer for so long, you're bound to make your money's worth. And you blow dry your hair almost every day, unless you have thick hair and use dry shampoo every day, which I don't, so. This is great, check it out. I'll include a link below. There are two, two different colors. I got the white and silver, but there's also a fuchsia and silver for those of you who are super girly and love the color pink. So check it out and keep it in mind for holiday gifts. It's a great idea. Stay tuned for more videos and I'll see you guys next time.